Uh, all I know, actually, this one's easier now. Hold on, last time I played this, I didn't have the cards I needed. You go back, because I was afraid of drawing you. What am I afraid of drawing here, John? I mean, if I hit Novin Gradian, not a big deal. We'll deal with it. Cleaver is perfect. Okay. But I think I think one thing I'm learning is I gotta go a little slower in round one. I love seeing monster plays humbled. Me too. <laughs> oh, is it bounty? That's perfect. That's like our ideal matchup. So I think one of my learnings right now is just play this matchup a little slower. Like in the past Salamander, it's like yeet all my cards on the table to try to force the forfeit. This time we take our time. No big deal. Not in a rush. Pirate, I like to see, oh, oh, you made it by pro by a point. Well, first, congrats. Second, I'm so proud of you. Third, well done. A pirate, Eric, welcome. Good to see you here, my friend. Been a little bit since I in the chat. Uh, as a monster man, this footage offend me. If it makes me feel better, monsters is my favorite too, but. Carapace, you know, stack up again, getting the strip of Salamander, even though you last say. Good. All is right in the world, guys. I mean, do I just eat out the cleaver, John? Yeah. Fine. I put him on the wrong side. I should have gone to the left. Just die, yeah. All right, we good? Oh yeah, we're good. Ah, uh, guess who's back? Back again. Mander's back. Hell, friends. Guess who's back? Guess who's back? I've been lurking lately. All good, and that's a good reminder to shout out to the legendary lurkers, all you wonderful people who are very near and dear to my heart. Thank you all for being such excellent supporters of the channel. Thank you so much. Did you just slander here as like an extra mulligan? Because I'm really good on coins. I think so. It's all right. We're alone here. Just uh, honestly, I'll shove Kuro's blacksmith to the bottom. Hmm. All the lurkers out there. How do you... Let's see. Round one. Just smashed my way through it. It's been a long Given the amount of like excess amounts of coins, we're just sending our deck right now. One less bad draw we get. Ah, uh, how's it going, Patsy? Artist. Oh, is that an artist of the heart? I love that. It's a Mr. Avila channel on that. Beautiful. Oh, we're doing so good. And if anyone wants the deck list, it is now on the deck list document. Go climb the pro, Salamander. I, I don't like it's supposed to be a meme, but man, are we, we are, what, how many games in a row? To be fair, I played a lot of Salamander. Um, Lurkers love you too. Oh, those are the kind words. Thank you, Patsy. Uh, we played one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We played ten games, we're eight and two. <laughs> All right, what am I missing? Just renew? Okay. Leave one here, Mancy, for it. All right, let's go in a game. Uh, do I have Equinox? Yeah. All right. Excuse me, sir. Could I have one opening Jacques, please? Okay. Do I just bait with Peaches? I probably just bait with Peaches. Um, I do need to get Jacques out of them soon. We're not really in a rush here. The only card I want is a Renew. Renew is Renew Mancy. All I want is Spring Equinox for Jacques and I win the game. That's been tilting me trying to make new decks, figure them out, like key up and sell the Nilfgaard games. Well, Pirate Eric, do you want know Salamander is very good against the uh, Nilfgaard Imprisonment Ball. Is it gonna be the video tomorrow? It totally is. Try right before people know what's happening. Yep, try it today, Xeniac, if you want to do it. It's gonna be the video tomorrow. It's going out at nine. Uh Yep, gonna be the video tomorrow, my friend. So, act fast or forever hold your peace. Let's see, Patsy had a good day? Awesome. 
Uh, two games we lost blood round two. I think so. Yeah, one was a symbiosis bleed, and the other one was oh no, Sy symbiosis e bleed, and one was an ice game. And running into ice made me realize I need to keep this in my deck at all times. Like I can't not have it anymore. So I started adding it in. Yep. What are you gonna do about that? Tainted ale. Sucks to suck. You have zero artifact removal because the only card that removes artifacts is neutral, and you are devotion. Let's see what you got, boy. I'm just going to start discarding cards until I force you to play either discard with me or play that shock. But this is this is the hope. My hope is you play shock here. I'll over profit by four. I'll have right here. Maybe I'll throw them. Nope. Not what I want. We're going on coins. I'm just going to waste my cards for a while. Because I'm sure he has slanderous hysterias in his hand. Uh, nope. Not what I'm looking for. I am looking for Jacques. That list is cut Jacques. Is that true? Infected? It's been a while since I saw you. Do I even want to play a card? Nah. You're confident? Is that true? I will say, they might just murder my poor um, Abomination because of uh, Caleb. Yes, I believe so, and hey, hey indeed. Been kinda busy? All good, my friend. I hope your life's going well. Part of being, part of being a member in the Plain Talk family is uh, doing what you can with what you got. I'm trying to figure out how I want to do this, John. I mean, everything I play dies, right? So it's really just, I get last save Salamander. Sure. Get wild, little guy. Watch your Salamander play, looks fun. I'll try it. It's had some trouble back when uh, Line Pockets was, thing, was king. Yeah, it's a lot easier now. Most decks are running devotion, so heat waves are less abundant. It's just easier. But this current list is really good at the round one. Slaughter your opponent, because the tunnel drill, cleaver, buffs the tiger's eye, pass the floor of peaches, tax collector. It's like a lot of little buffs go a long way. Correct, Xeniac. I, it's not an ideal matchup, I don't think. I think we just there's a lot of possibilities to lose immediately. Not the dead one. I'd imagine for our little brother. If they have Jacques, we lose. If it's not Jacques, we win. A lot comes down to what our good friend Infected said. If it's day of Jock, we lose. Hey, morning. Hello, Akinim. How's it going? I saw you briefly during the interview. Didn't uh, focus on the interview, but I saw your name pop up. Hope you enjoyed it. I think the Phil I saw you were getting confused by some of the, uh, the crazy philosophical top, but I will say we're talking wild ideas. We're all over the place. I popped in at a weird moment. Oh, you totally did. The first like hour and a half of that interview got philosophical, and it was a blast. I mean, do you have Jacques? Like, this is, the, this is the only question on my mind right now. If you have Jacques, you win. If you don't have Jacques, I think I win. Can't find Witchfinder without cutting Jacques? Probably. I hope so. You and I both know it's coming. I think it's... I know. This has to be Jacques. Jacques or a spell. Nothing loose. I wish I was with you guys from the beginning that Sand died. Ah, well, whacking in. We're, uh, I'm uploading it on YouTube tomorrow. It should be on Spotify as well. Uh, but I need to do some edits to Spotify because it currently has my full name on it. And, uh, but yeah, it's going to be too. So don't worry. Yeah, big you already used Kurt. Kurt might cost him the game. If that last card is removal, you lose this here. But you, it'll be... Oh! <laughs> Oh, I am Parf. Go to Deckless. I just added it to the Deckless stock. Check the Salaman there. Uh, 
love Tangy Dale so much for this exact play. <laughs> Did you? This feels so good. This feels so. I feel like I'm cheating as I'm playing this game. Oh no. <laughs> um, probably Mulligan. You weirdly enough. And you? Uh, our matchup with the elf card is really good. As long as you spring. Oh, God, this deck feels good, you guys. So, I made just such tiny changes here. At no need for a dating anymore. Welcome back, Cleaver. Clean up tax collectors and uh, passies instead of the poison package. Add in the curse blacksmiths instead of the halfling safe crackers. And boy, we're in business immediately. Defeat them with hunger. Crush them with thirst. Actually, I mean, we should be... I think one thing I'm learning, though... Maybe opening this aggressively immediately isn't correct. Sometimes things like tax collector opening, stuff like that. A little slower now. Every time you come, you're teaching some of the power of Silent Maps, then I misplay again. Yep, Frogman, which is why there was a time when I was just binging Viper, and I just could not win games as Viper. Because <laughs> those videos were blowing up on YouTube, and everyone understood the shenaniganry I was trying to do. Oh, and then when I get meme pop and things go crazier... Zaniac, if somebody makes a Reddit post, you get a new copy pasta for the chat. I'm a big fan, you know? It's, a shame I have to... it's always good to get a new copy pasta. I'm a dwarf of Tax collector click. I don't think anybody expects Line Pock to be Salamander, so they don't even know you're trying to tell you. Yep, Malgorn back uh, in the previous time when Line Pockets was OP. That's his, this is the deck, roughly what we ran. I did cut out a cleaver for Line Redanian after a while. But Tunnel Drill, this round one, everyone felt good. We blew all of our good cards in round three. It was just Salamander. It killed so many people on ladder. Uh, Viper Battle Rush was the first time I ever played Viper. It was great. It was like a 10 out of 10 experience. Would recommend. I can't wait to indulge. Alright, the forfeit. Alright, we fake crimes indeed. I saw we could all be back. You can play Salamander on it? Probably. I mean, I enjoy battle rushing meme decks. I think it's super hard. They usually fail because you just can't click everything fast enough, but it's a lot of fun. You people usually think you're an idiot. Yep, using Cleaver and Draw Round 1. Yep, that's all I do. I do it every time. And <laughs> have, surprise, surprise, we're in a lot of those games. Yeah, I, I like this better in Jackpot Salamander. This just feels so crisp. I win. I will say Nelf card is a particularly easy matchup, though they can insta-kill me. There is a combo of cards they can use to guarantee the win against me. I'm like, fine. You get tunnel vision and I want neither win around one. Yep. That's the problem. Oh, they did change the animation thing. Yes, the air horn sounds a fair thing. It might actually be more playable now. Which is something I would very much like for the record. Like, if I can click a little faster. Seasonal? I can't wait to do that. I think near the end of this stream, oh, we're going to have to try a new seasonal. Because Patience is a Virtue is just such a fun seasonal. It's such a wacky, wacky way to play the game. Bloody height, second night, the only thing I'm afraid of is Gorther. So you can, you can pinch. If you are playing Devotion. Devotion. Uh, Devotion Nilf Guard. Then you can pinch if you're running Quad Joachim, a, a Salamander, by keeping Yenvo and as your last card in Gorther out. So if they kill Salamander and it goes to the grave, you Gorther on top of their deck. If they, if they leave it out and they don't put it in the grave, then you Yenvo it. So you pinch it. But I don't even know if my English made sense, but the idea made sense. 
Let's see. Trying to make a White Frost Maddock deck today. I just couldn't get the work. How am I complete my contract? What's your contract, Malgorn? I try to point you how I would do it. Love to see that. That opens up a lot of possibilities. Your name, young man, the man should be cursed into an urge. Okay, only thing I'm afraid of right now is course, sir. Falling behind. Better luck next time, huh? Alright, we're at seven. Gorther is the only card I'm afraid of. Because Gorther gives him a one nine shot of instantly winning the game. Renew in the deck against Nilfgaard. Ah, Zaniac. That's a Giga Brain move, my friend. As long as I'm Renew, man, so you're right. I could just do it that way, Zaniac. Oh, Zaniac, that's kind of clutch. I like where your head's at, friend. Maybe I'll do it like that. That's a fair flop. You're right. I could just keep it in the deck. As long as I draw a Salamander this next round, that line of play seems very good. To your <laughs> keep renewing the deck. Keep the Ornier Mance ready to go. I like it. Winning with White Frost. Uh, Malgorn. I would try a Siri Nova Frost deck or something like that. Nah, would I do that? Maybe I would. I would just use it. The best luck I've ever had of White Frost was having your leader ability be the only Frost cards in like the five point bronzes that are really good. I guess I'm looking for hideout here. Um. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. So, Xenic, what I can do here, I just realized I forgot the mulligan it, but I have blind eye or eavesdrop. I can just eavesdrop, puts this in my last card in the deck, and then I'm good. So, what you can do is you can eavesdrop it. Yeah, but it's not even a shuffle back. It's a put on the bottom of your deck, so they can't even yoink it for Contarella. Alright, so this game we've already won. Uh, I did a vote from Wild Time. Yeah, I feel like my the trick when when I play weather is. What am I looking for? Okay. You get a draft. Let me shut the door. And you goes on the bottom. One, two. The bank next, maybe? They got the hideout. Maybe near the end though. But when I play White Frost, the best luck I've had is White Frost Leader, the Naglafar's crew, and that's it. And then set up a Lacerate off of whatever the whatever the organic tutor two point is. And then that's so they they row pack to avoid the white frost and you just splash over Lacerate for a lot of points. New fog lights. I like the new fog lights as a one-up. They don't work well if you have a pair in your hand because you don't want to sack weather. But they were quite good as one-ups. Deals, deals. Novigrad's built deals. Who know a ball? I know, right? I mean, for me, the best part is Dead Man's Tongue's probably wiped away his spies. And then Bratfins is gone, so I'm pretty clear on the abomination. Just go wild here. They're like, what is this card doing? I'm like, it's doing its best. Art Gaif is cool with New Angel Fogus though. Maybe I always hated Art Gaif. I always felt like it was very weak. I always felt like it was like under. Wow, you didn't wipe away the dashes for him, but you played it. I love this. This feels really good. I wonder if they've noticed I'm playing like a fool. Probably, right? I think I do now. I do actually need hideout. I need points here. This game is going so well. I feel so bad. Some in the world's doing their best. They're like, I got the ladder. I'm going to play the very, very powerful Nilfgaard Imprisonment Devotion deck. And I'm sitting here like, bring Equinox. Bring Equinox. Lock that drill. Lock that drill. Put me in my place. Lock that everything here. I'm gonna slaughter you today. 
that drill. Lock that drill. Oh my gosh, it's ball. What are we going to do about that? We're going to make it fall. Welcome to the ball. Ba -da -da -da. Welcome to the ball. Ba -da -da -da. I mean, I'm so pumped. Like it was a mistake. Oh, which card? The tunnel drill? Oh, yeah. That's what you mean, Johnny. I like where your head's at. I like it. Gotta bluff it till you make it, you know? Alright, I'll play team today. I'll go. Do you know? I don't think you do. You dwarf me by three times my points. Woo hoo. I love this moment. Like, you know it's gonna be like an 8,000 point. Like, quite literally an 8,000 point. <laughs> Tactical nuke coming soon. I'm sure there's somebody in the world, someone's starting to feel like nervous. Like, something. Something is wrong. There is a disturbance in the force. One little beautiful mander. I'm ready to meet the people. Say hello to the world. And I'm just casually playing cards. Lamau. Lamau. I don't care if they wait for Usurper. Usurper is only scary in this deck, not because of the six points. Usurper is scary when you play it early. I don't have an answer to it. You start smacking Brathens in the Emissary, followed by a second Emissary giving it plus 14 so it's at least a 20 point card if not higher because of its passive that's when things get scary um, but because it's not happening right now I'm not like particularly worried Third time's the charm, what do you say? so that happens that's when soldier mages vampires or a slippery boy uh i hate so much elf card well mill uh sakurado first welcome to the chat second this one's for you my friend if you hate Nilfgaard, this match is for you. I'll let you really savor it. If we say it's favored in a bounty SY, I would probably give it to Nilfgaard in that matchup. They have a lot of good point slam and enough interaction with bounty that they can be tough. And then Swing Grinox could be a problem. We'll see. I'm going to delay it as long as possible. I get me a usurper general, please. I would like to order one. No, I am glad ball starting to pop out. We need more of those things out. Let's see. Well, I, I did dedicate the match already. I'm nervous. Woo, baby. They have a lot of points here. Jeez, man. That's brutal. Ooh, that's deep. Three down. Yeah, I still think we have enough points if I did my math right. I think I can't afford the tribute, though. Yeah, can't we full. It can't. We were at ten coins there. You need eleven to pay tribute, so we're gonna decline tribute to make sure my dom can go off. Slippery boy, just laughing, indeed. I'm not I'm not worried about last play server there's so let's just assume let's just go for their hand right it's usurper Yenvo and two other cards uh probably an Ana I don't know the last maybe not an Ana they haven't been too willy-nilly with this oh let's assume Ana though and something else excuse me sir could I could I please have oh that's true it does give them a lot spread out we'll be fine Zaniac don't you worry this is an easy one. Come on. Yenvo. Or Usurper. Give it to me. That's true. Usurper, Usurper last sight could be good for them. That's very tragic. Ana? Okay, do you have Ana? Maybe we do lose this one. We're going to find out. I haven't seen Gorth there. Hmm. Bring Equinox is looking pretty hot. Like, I have to play it next. Oh! <laughs> Give it to me. Oh! 
Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Mmm. Mmm. That's not what you want to be looking at, bud. Ah, that's what you like to see. Hey, yo. Hmm. All right. It's not Gorther. Oh, this is so good. Talk about a nail biter. So glad to see that you surf for play. I was leaning a little worried because there was Zanier was correct. Keep one charge here, discard your aristocrats. Like this is your last card. Brock, um, 12 off here and a four off here for 16 spread out. It's a lot of points. Enough for me to deal with. Uh, I could deal a good chunk of it, but I'm not sure I'd have enough. But uh, how's it going? Ooh, look at that yen though. Oh yeah, get all the coins. Get all the coins. Spread out those points. Do it. You know what? I'm not angry. I know what you're trying to do. Give me the satisfaction and I appreciate you. Do it all. Do it all. Do it all. I'll be kind too. I'll just go for it. Instead of going for a kill, none of them avail. None of them have points. We're going to just go for the perfect kill here. I appreciate him lining it up a little bit higher. Nice of him. Ah, it's so good. That was a close one. Woo! Ooh, 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 ooh. Was that close? Was that a close game? Mmm. GG. Well, yeah, I said, oh, yeah. You know what, Bubble Trub? I'm going to win anyways because you just challenged the Gwent Dodds saying you know what goes on inside their head. I'm going to crush it. The Vita, I find the cute meme on the ladder. Oh, you do find the cute meme on the ladder. So many people's meta decks don't know, have any. Because there's so many devotion decks now, they're not taking Heat Wave. Or don't know how to handle it. It's it's beautiful. It's just uh, you'll be that we're just we're clapping. Every Nilfgaard ball deck is just dying. Uh, we just took down a She Who Knows deck. Oh, it's so good. Gravecaller, welcome. Good to see you in the chat. Welcome to the chat. But oh my gosh. Oh, I don't care about round three. We're gonna we'll figure it out. Single Salamander jackpot. It's so much more boring. It's a more boring way to play, in my opinion. I am though. I know I'm the unpopular one. Unpopular one. Playing old school auto kill everything, but I'm all about the old school auto kill everything lifestyle, I confess. With their brother that gives you coins. I know, Libby. I tried it. It's not as fun as just slaughtering everything on the board and winning one point only. Zaniac, I, I, you guys are all talking about me getting humbled. I don't really think I want to get humbled. I'm, I respect you guys. I appreciate all of you for saying I'm going to get humbled. I don't really feel like it. Let it be known I have no interest. I intend to crush them. If I can. You need to extreme. You need to humiliate me. have Exodia. Yep. Uh, are they taunting me? I keep them muted. I guess so. But, uh, Levita, you're right. It gets you, like, a million points. I just... The thing about Salamander is if I just win by one point, it's still enough. Yeah? Not sure about the spawn. Went back and forth on that one. I mean, it is a cute idea. That's it. Ah, okay, just sharing the idea. No worries. I tried it. It was. It, I ran. It was really funny. Levita earlier today is we ran into somebody doing that idea. So I'm playing Dallas double salamander. They're playing jackpot salamander, and oh, that's hot. That's so hot. I like that. That means they're not running in. <laughs> I mean, honestly, at this point, I'm just gonna go like this. No. You're what? Seven? Yeah. All right, I think it's their turn. They face it at like two. Really? That's interesting. 
Yeah, so I ran into it. It was it was so funny. I think I wonder if it'll take off because we did lay like a 44 point uh, Roland off the bat, but it was so awkward because I was the one triggering his Roland. He chose to discard his Salamander. I smacked it down. Yes, I yeah. Uh... Uh, hey, new family member, uh, Clifton W07. Welcome to the Plain Talk family. I'm so glad I said to join us here today as we try to figure out how they're going to win the game when I pass here. Hey, two new family members, uh, Clifton W. I'm so glad you could join us here today as we get down to the local rodeo to see the races. Welcome aboard. And Quaspard, Quas or Quaspard, welcome to the Plain Talk family. I'm so glad you could join us here today as we do ancient rituals to summon up from the, uh, summon something incredible. From the ruined states of the world. Welcome aboard. I don't know. Both of you guys get in the chat. Meet the people. Say hello to me. I'll say hello to you. Ah, Quest Park. Good to see you already in the chat. How's it going? I stream six days a week, eight hours per day, Sunday night off. I'm around the lot. Actually, I stream seven hours a day now. Uh, reducing it slightly so I don't go crazy. Check out the YouTube Discord and Twitter. They're super popping. Keep you informed what's going on. Uh, Ninja King, no full screen welcomes. Not anymore. This is the, this is the compromise. Plain Talk John is one of the two games they lose. Ouch. Northern Realms is broken. Really? Northern Realms is the broken one? Interesting. Nope card seem very well positioned. I don't really get what we're doing here, but do your best, bud. I'm proud of you. I mean, I'm assuming... I don't actually know what you're doing here. Do you not like Syndicate? That's okay, Gravecrawler. Uh, okay. Did you do all that just for that? Okay. I mean, like, you get Sabbath. Northern Realms is broken, but I lose, uh, only lose Kelly. But I auto lose to it. Interesting. Okay. Alright, you seven cards and a Shiyu Nose. I mean, if you bleed, it's gonna be a pain. Uh, I'll figure it out then. Oh, I don't have, I don't have Equinox. Or oh, do you even have a Neomancy? No. Buff draws there. You want to be kind enough and just pass here, bud? Oh, uh, no wonder they've played so out. So they're at 7 or 9, but they got last save for me. Maybe I will lose this one. No, 100% 10 point care is worth two cards. It's like worth two bad cards though, Zaniac. Lovely means friendly sometimes. Potato just smacked the crap out of me. <laughs> uh, Libita, you're gonna hook up the chat the, the OP Northern Realms list. Everyone in the chat's like, yeah, just, you know, that sounds. Honestly, is Tunnel Drill worth it? Probably not. There are worlds where I need Tunnel Drill, I think, more in Pass Flora. It's been a long, hard road, hasn't it? Should have bled one more card there. Uh, but that's alright. Because, like, I won the round. Got rid of Shiyu Nose, but we'll see. If they... No, there's no way you fit. Kelly. Well, I don't care about Kelly. I do care about... The lack of... Wow, we got full combo. We are... So freaking lucky, jeez. Oh, we got full combo about Bank or Near Mancy, but I did not get Equinox. I got to eavesdrop it off the top. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so we have, we have a basically like a two and no, we got a we got a 50-50 guys. No points last, so you got uh still the problem in the last day, so points matter do matter. They do indeed matter here. Let's see. How do you win of a ton of Veil? Well, Libita, we, we're taking an OP card called Spring Equinox, but I don't have it in my hand, so please. Remember, yep, you never miss. This, this is uh, this is like child's play in here, right? I'll ditch the tunnel drill here. All right, we're near Mancy online. Tunnel, to ton, to, not tunnel drill, but uh, Spring Equinox is a go. Points will matter, so I'm gonna try to pass you out soon. I see you win of being talented. Thank you. Thank you. You're correct, Libita. 
I hope this person tutors up Kelly. Please tutor up Kelly. Oh. We're really good on coins here because we're sitting on Swindle. So let's go wild. Ah, uh, we can't deny the town. Also, by the way, they already spent Squirrel, so I know really I can just shove it into the grave. Not worry about Heat Wave. Worry about Heat Wave, not just Squirrel. Not the Squirrel. Ozra last is bad. What if they have Kelly now? Play. <laughs> Kelly. Play. Kelly. But da but da play. Kelly. Play play the Kelly. I don't think they do. I think they caught. I put in a. Uh, sure. Deals, deals. No regrets, build deals. Play the Kelly. Play the Kelly. I think they cut Siri Dash, and I think they cut Kelly for Shio Knows. I think that's my take on it right now. Beautiful. It's so beautiful. Thimble fingers in a warm spot. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is so good. This is just, mm, mm, I feel myself just like relaxing into my chair. Oh, look at that kill. Got me so good. Oh, yeah. Mmm. It's the stuff, guys. Oh. Can't, I don't know what to say. We're not in the clear yet. Osril's a huge issue for our deck, but. Sure. Whatever you want, man. Mostly the one card I'm missing is like an actual spend there, but I'll just trust Passable or Peaches to carry me out of this one. Osril still might get me in the end, though. I'd love it when Osril's a pain. I don't really have a lot of points. Unless I was able to get, like, Sea Jackal. And maybe I was supposed to get Sea Jackal instead of Passy, but we're going to spend a good chunk of coins. We are sitting on Tainted today, which helps. No, I think you just keep playing obnoxiously here. Like, notice, I bet their hand has a bunch of stuff with, like, removal that they really want to use. But. That's fair. Xaniac, anything else probably doesn't matter too, too much here. Lack of last say makes me sad. I think I just passed earlier. We might still get humbled here. Okay, God, you must hate me. Oh, God must love me. Um. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> okay. It's good for killing some ass about it. Yeah, we have backup kill as well. I don't think it's the four of it, guys. Don't get too don't get too excited. I'm enjoying this. I'm savoring this because I'm sure they know something is wrong. But like, if he's sitting on Aussie, I'm gonna just eat it, right? Because they they took this guy down fast. I'm looking at. <sighs> it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough. I don't know how. It just depends. If it's points in hand. We're good. If it's removal on hand, we might lose. And a lot's coming up here. Will he lose in the most annoying way possible? I think that's probably correct here, Libido. I think it's a good read. It'll be close. Two points of turn damage is rough, I'm not gonna deny. And maybe in retrospect, Team Diddle murder that was correct.
If you lose, because uh, probably Nith throw around three and not two. Or one. Or three instead of one. Yeah, maybe. I mean, there's a weird, weird brew they're putting together. And they might get us. Again, this is the one ability I'm afraid of. Because Carabas, Cave Troll, it's like Dash. It's just so infuriating. If they get multiple last saves, we lose. <gasps> and they're going to kill those tall removal, aren't they? Okay, I do not know what's in their deck. That is a confirmed fact. I have no idea what's going on currently. At this point, we're just all in and praying. I do not know any card in their deck at this point. I legitimately haven't a clue of what we're about to run into. But can we do it? Can we do it? This is the weirdest game I've ever played. They might have multiple scrolls. Oh, what the heck is their deck? It's beyond my understanding. My comprehension has failed. I repeat, comprehension has failed. If you run multiple scrolls, I will cry. I'd love to see a win here too. I, I'm really, I'm looking for it. I'm looking for it. I don't know if we have it though. I only have a nine. He might just not be enough here. As long if it's not Ozril, we're good. If it's Ozzy, he eats the Salamander, we lose. And I'm basically banking that it's not Ozril. I was more afraid of Heat Wave or a Banish Bomb. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, gods of the game, it is I your favorite. Oh, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Oh no, John, you blew two points. You blew two points. I was too excited. No. Made a mistake. I killed you. I didn't have to kill you. If I lose by two points, it's my fault. I got too excited. Please be removal. Please be removal. If I lose by two, if it's an 11 point Aussie, like, fine, I eat it. Yes! Let's go! Where there's a will, there's a way! Ah, uh, <laughs> GG. Just giving you all a little bit of extra excitement at the end. Let's go! Um, yeah, how do we do? Jeez. Hands are so good. First Swarm is bad for us. No, nah, nah. If it's Crow Swarm, we're going second. We're fine. Uh, we just did that, Infected. We just did that. We got into Carapace matchup, but it was like a she-who-knows-Carapace hybrid. Yeah, I won that game. It looks like everyone round one. Yeah, exactly. It's not necessary, but a round two bleed is an instant loss. So if you lose round one, but they don't bleed round two, you still have a shot. If you lose round one and they bleed you hard round two, you're just dead in the water. Scar Druid's Mother. I mean, I'm, I think that's probably a good read into what we're about to play against. Yes, I would agree. Let's go ahead and just do this. Hmm. Feels good. Welcome to the chat, by the way. Uh, was it Grimson? Grimson? Welcome to the chat. All right, let's clean this up before it gets too much more out of hand. Most wholesome weather, uh, uh, most wholesome opponent so far. Yes, we've faced uh, mostly degeneracy today, which happens. It's like fine, you know. You're guaranteed six, seven coins right now. Okay. Could have done probably one more proc, because if they kill it. Perfect. That's so good. That's perfect. Seven. Near Mancy, get me one, one fancy drill. Clean out everything they hope and love. This is my okay. Stunning blow doesn't work. Gutting slash doesn't work. If you have Giga Decoction, eh, maybe should have gone for two there. Oh yeah, should have gone for two. That's my bad. Not too much, eh? How far can we bleed? How much clog you face? Infected? Actually, zero. It's uh, becoming a very unpopular Nilfgaard deck because it's teching a Purify and a Heat Wave is pretty easy. Or Tall Removal. 
So, it's not been working out for people as much anymore. I think it's become pretty known how to beat the deck. You'll die, but be a, another spender. Uh, I mean, I'll keep bleeding the whole way. So I don't, now we need we need some luck. We're looking for combo pieces and cleaver. Cleaver is key here. Do you play other games uh, playing those, John? You'll start seeing that again, wacky name. I've kind of taken a break from it while the new expansion had come out, but it's time to get them back into the fold. Ah, uh, beautiful. So oh, beautiful. That's exactly the card I was looking for. Why do I want Cleaver here? I'm so glad everyone asked. Because a 10 point slam is hard to deal with. Like, they shouldn't have a 10 pointer. Oh, wait, I don't even need that. I get double SA already. They're at 7, I'm at 7. No, they went a turn early. They need to back out on 5 cards. Uh, is wise to use your bank? Yeah, sweet candy. It was really wise to use my bank. Uh, because right now. No, I don't even have to play a card, do I? I just pass and I get double SA. So there's risk. There's risk right now that we'd miss our uh, combo pieces, but I get double assay, which means I can salamander poison everything and then renew it to kill everything. So as long as I get combo, they instantly lose the game without a way to answer it. So all I need, yeah, I don't need bleed it. I went to four. I thought there were five. Five, if they're then we eat on eight. If I can get more points than them in one card, then they lose the game. Uh, there's the man there. There's that. I mean, coins are great. Don't really need you then. Spring Ox is good as backup. I uh, don't need to see Jackal because we got a double. Only card I missed. Ooh, I'm missing two cards here. Ooh, missing two cards, John. Bank worked out well, but we might lose the game. Hey, Miss Lady J. Yes, raid indeed. Miss Lady J, welcome. Has my raid notification been busted or something? Hey, Miss Lady J, thank you for the raid. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ah. Oh. So wonderful. Thank you so much. Hey, new family member. Uh, Boba Marco, welcome to the Plain Talk family. I'm so glad you could join us here today as we learn all about the history of Yggdrasil, the tree of the world, or whatever it's called, world tree. Welcome aboard. Get in the chat, meet the people, say hello to me, I'll say hello to you. I stream six days a week, eight hours, maybe Sunday, Monday off. I'm Ryan Lock coming out. Welcome to the family. Uh, YouTube, Discord, and uh, YouTube are popping, so if any of the Raiders likes what they see, feel free to check out the social links. Uh, we might be about to lose. I have a 50-50 here. I actually have a 40% chance of winning. I went for a risk. 40% chance of winning, guys. Am I going to lose here? No. I cannot be stopped, I'm afraid. We just won the game. All right. Well, welcome, everyone. I'm glad we got to. We had a 40% chance. It was a little tighter than I want. Uh, we just won. The game's over. Lucky your skill. I don't know. I can't say. Whatever. This is about to put us, what, 9-2 of Salamander today? And this will be our sixth win in a row, now that we got a good list together. I'm, uh, I'm quite pleased. John, am I cheating? Am I cheating, Kasari? Am I, am I cheating, guys? Did we talk about the Squirrel? Squirrel, uh, yeah, they can talk about, talk about Squirrel Baron. I have double last day currently, because I played Risky in the round once to enjoy this. Uh, and I'm getting rewarded to it for it right now. I mean, honestly, I could spawn one, couldn't I? No, I can't risk it. I mean, it doesn't matter, I suppose. There's no point in risking it. If you... Sweet Candy, don't you dare say those words. Don't you dare. Oh, scroll up. Rat, uh, Rat of Scar works that well for our you can just show, uh, discussion. But... Sweet Candy, don't you say those words. That color might be busted if you're not bled. It's it's still, if you don't get last say, it still hurts. But yes, it is one you want to bleed. It's hard to bleed into the cleaver and tunnel drill going off. Like it's only a matter of increasing your odds. Just the right thing. Opportunities to shoot for the moon. True. Common make you so happy. Why would it make anybody here happy? Hey, new family member. Uh, Glo uh, Glosba. Glosba. Welcome to the Plain Talk family. So honored you decided to join us here today as we learn all about the anatomy of scorpions. Welcome aboard. Go to get in the chat, meet the people, say hello to me, I'll say hello to you. I stream six days a week, seven hours per day. YouTube, Discord, and Twitter are popping. Links in the chat. Check them out. You'll love them. Someone tell Mr. Opponent it doesn't matter. <laughs> if 
If I see a combi, I'll cry. I will literally just straight up lose this game immediately. 100% every single time. Anatomy of Scorpions, yep. Oh yeah, we kind of definitely got to purify the defender, right? Oh yeah, you got me, bud. We'll run upon the crest of the waves, neath your wings outstretched. Ah, no combi. Hope for it. That was what you did. That's so rude. Come on, swim the anatomy of salamanders. It's, it's it's beautiful, guys. It's a beautiful day. Oh, I'm going to enjoy this. This one's from Miss Lady J for the excellent raid. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Honestly, it gets even better. Let me show you me. Ah, no, I was gonna use. Storm to kill this, but that's gone. I think we just go for the one pointer again. I've been just doing one point wins all day instead of just like anything normal. There it is. GG. I'm a little sad that they didn't let me do it, but like, all right, enjoy your GG and then you go. It's a good hand. It's a good hand. Uh, don't need Sea Jackal. Don't need Sea Jackal. Definitely don't need you. Alright. Better than paying taxes. <laughs> this isn't Clogger. This is Ball. No one's in deck, right? Are you gonna make that again? What's going on? I don't know what you guys are doing in chat anymore. How can I tell what it is? I just, if I see somebody with imprisonment, I usually in their um. I mean, I guess they could have been. I just, Cloggers is becoming less and less popular and less and less viable a deck by every passing day. I would shock me if anyone puts a tier two when they do the meta reports. I think it'll be a tier three deck. Um, where it belongs. Uh, I think uh, Clogger is not nearly as good as Imprisonment Ball. So until I see a Clogger card, it's going to just assume it's this. You want to tell me Scroll Scroll? Yeah, but like... You, you, I will be honest, if you're playing Gwent right now in this meta, you do not, under any circumstance, want to be the one... Um, in this world, only two things are certain. You do not want to currently in this meta be playing uh, Cloggers. Cloggers is not a very good deck in the meta. I would be, I would be hanging out whatever you can. Oh, you guys are spamming. Do your copy pasta. Hey, Granita, it's good to see you here, my friend. What's up? Is that the Salamander? So it's here. That's, we have a copy pasta Salamander complaint. <laughs> uh. Okay. I mean, I guess we're done here, right? We got like nothing else better to do than just kill their souls and dreams, you know? Our hopes and dreams, souls and dreams, all the same, really. I'm kind of hard pressed to commit uh, any coins over here. Yeah, I think it's passing. Clogger will bring shame to your family. Yeah, I mean, we still could lose. Like, if they figure out what we are quickly, we're going to eat it here. But I don't think they will. Now we just mulligan for combo pieces. I did not get a lot of the cards I like to see, but it's okay. Actually, we're missing a lot of cards. Maybe this will be the time we just don't draw. Heal, purify, it's all the same. We got, we got the OP. Get some man 2600 I'll sub at the highest Patreon level. Uh, I'll keep that in mind. I don't think I'm going to grind the 26. We might end up hitting 25. Uh, if we decide to grind this tomorrow as well. 
And honestly, you probably won't win other things. But I, I do want to call out that for the record, this is not healthy. This is not healthy that the game is currently operating like this. Like, we should not be winning games of Salamander. And uh, yeah, we're, we're crushing the ladder of Salamander. Uh, it's like, <laughs> we're at 20, 2450. This is so dumb. <laughs> this is so, so, so dumb. They're all dying. And speaking of Patreon, hey, I appreciate the bug there, Bubble Chub. Uh, there it is. Boom. Appreciate, appreciate it. Oh, that's pretty good for us. I Quite yeah, you got me. You get us so soundly. Whatever will I do? What's the secret behind your energy? Um, trying to eat some trail mix on stream. Looking forward to what you do. I don't know. Things are good. Things are good. Oh boy, guys. Mmm. This is the stuff. This is the stuff. The stuff's coming in. So hot. Actually, we might lose here. I'll be really blunt. Okay, how many pieces am I short? Do I have bank? I have bank. Bank needs madame, and then we have to tutor for new. Okay. I think it's like a summon that enemy points don't matter. Amen, sweet candy. That is the stuff. I, I thought I... No, I have, a, I have a tier above 12, bud. There is a, I think, a $24 tier. Or something like that. Tainted Ale is good, but optional. It's not required for this matchup. Really good to keep, though. Uh, it will help a lot. We're not going to get that opportunity. Uh, but I think I can create the situation I'm looking for here. So if I open Cleaver, I wonder if I can bait the Yenvo here, maybe? Um, there should be a higher one. My, uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, it's a $24 one. Why, why 24 Just make it 25 I thought 24 sounds cheaper than 25 so people would be more willing to subscribe. And they're all going off of four uh, decimals of four, because $4 is cheaper than a $5 sub on Twitch. Again, guys, not obligated, is appreciated. John knows his marketing. Yep. That's the thought. Someone's like, would I rather sub on Twitch? Which you can't do currently do because I'm not a partner or affiliate. Yeah. But as my thought was later on, if you could sub on Twitch or put an ad block on Twitch and then, you know, put four bucks in the Patreon, one of those gets me significantly more money. Can't imagine which one, right? Uh. <laughs> That's it. Halfway there. Actually, is Renew the one we're missing? Oh, yeah, we can't lose this game. This game's over. This game is so dead. This game is so, so over. Um, fascinating. Okay, well, I don't want to approach this one, John. Let's start here. <laughs> now this is a knife. The game. No experience. Wait, wait, SK, Nilfgar, no ball, please. Uh, Granitas, you're currently asking for the impossible. No one's found a good SK deck, and Cloggers is your best on Nilfgar of no ball, but ball is by far the better deck. The equivalent of setting a 2499 set 25. Yep, Xeniac, that's 100%. Why it is what it is. Ice is good. Ice is okay. I don't think it's that good. I think the point slams from other ones are... I think it's hard to win round one without... Because everything's so low because veteran hasn't kicked in yet. And then having to find a way... Let's start... Um, painted ale, huh? I'm not exactly starving for coins. But uh, we'll do features here. Oh, yeah, hold on. I made a premium. That's just such a gross premium. We got the flies flying about. But, guys, we are. Another victim's are gonna come soon. Tainted Ale's a good draw here. Oh, you don't wanna be playing Rathens. Because they can Dutch us and form it the uh, Salamander Abomination. But now we went extra hard, which is the spirit. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, the card, why we were so afraid of Usurper Emperor is Brathens either copying Abominations or Brathens Emissary on Usurper Emperors is a serious problem for this deck. Now we'll just go ahead and do that. Go. 
The only way I think I lose right now is Gorther swap top of my deck sniper now or snipe Madame. But that's uh that's a painful thing to admit. Hmm. Like if that happens, it just happens. I can't do anything about it. Now might be the moment they know. If they're, if they're not running Gortha, though, have we even seen Duet? No, they have a different deck. I think they moved away. I think this deck moved away from Quad Duet. I, also, I honestly, by the way, I think moving away from Quad Duet is correct. Uh, you are, you are, uh, Yoakim Duet, same thing. Uh, Yoakim Quad, I think, is unnecessary compared to what other options are out there. But you don't have to agree with me. How many coins do I have? Infinite. I'm gonna do a different line of play here. I wanna I wanna reduce the odds of that being the fate. The best way to do that is we're gonna play a little bit weird here. Do I wanna play a little bit weird? Yes. Dumb. Play it. Hey. Go. Turn. This looks weird. I'm really starting to get worried about the swap, though. If they swap and they hit Renew, we lose. So what we're going to do is just play this here. Use Swindle, get the coins back I need. Uh, then Purify. Correct. We're not going to go Abomination this game. We're going to actually be going for Failed Experiment this game. We have enough coins to do it. But I'm trying. At this point, I need to close up ways we're going to lose. And if I do Abomination, they're just going to Imprisonment Lock. And then I lose. So I don't want to let that happen. Yeah, clear them out. It's fine. Uh, so because if I play, if I play the, I think it's a higher chance of me going abomination than kill it with double imprisonment, or a single imprisonment, uh, or double imprisonment and coup. Like there was a bunch of ways to get the abomination. I'm afraid of that. So I'm gonna lean into the failed experiment here. And hope to win off of that. The ball's done. That's done. Sure. Uh, there's a really, really real chance I win this at one point. Uh, because what I'm going to do is... I'm going my back row. Yeah, I mean, now they know. If they don't know now and they see a spring equinox after my dom... Oh, I would get nervous. I would get so nervous at this point. Because I could do it to this row and knock off Yoakim for going for a second shot. But can you imagine sitting there being like, This person is so confident they're going to win. So confident they're gonna win that they just <laughs> just removed the veil of the usurper. Oh yeah, now they're reacting. Immediately start smacking. Actually, they're just gonna play Ana here for nothing. No, there is no other. There is no other veil. Speak your mind. To the point. Now we go Salamander it out. Take a failed experiment. Play it. Because they can eat up my coins. We have plenty. And now, like, they don't get the benefit of copying or queuing some Andrew Abominations. Lord Wubbuffet, what did you do? Did you do the combo? Because there's a world where, like, I do the... Inf yeah, like, if I did this earlier and did the Abomination, they would double Imprisonment or Imprisonment queue that, and I'd be in problem. You hit pro? I'm so proud of you. Congratulations. Congratulations. I'd love to hear that. Ooh, lock the failed experiment. Lock the failed experiment. Oh. Well, you know the rules, and so do I. Hi. Goodbye, Envo. I'm just gonna go for the flaws victory again, I think. Xavier, they're in devotion. There it is. G G. Thank you so much to Pamsasaurus and Ahmed Ali for being such great patrons.